Hey guys, it's Sasha Tirupati and I'm here again with a new tutorial video. A lot of you guys have been writing in to me asking how to become a playback singer. And honestly, I have kind of made it here on my own. I didn't really know a lot of people. What I'm going to tell you about today is some tips. Um, and again, guys, there's no hard and fast rule that if you follow what I'm telling you, you're going to become a playback singer. These are the things that I did that worked for me and that I would love to share with you if it helps you at all. So three tips. First thing was consistency. I made it a point to be consistent in my efforts in meeting people, in, in going and getting my work noticed, in going and putting my work out there, in going and playing my songs to composers and so you need a great demo put your best together at that time i mean when i initially started i put everything on an audio cd <laughs> and i would carry that audio cd and stand and wait outside studios for composers and then you know quickly go and give it to them and tell them like, hey you know like whenever you get a chance please do listen to this so i was consistent with it tip number two is practicing behind the microphone i think that is very important so that you're prepared when you're called um, it's very different when you go out and perform live. It's very different when you, I mean, at least for me, uh, it's very different when you're in the studio singing. So the more well-versed you are in a cons condenser microphone, consender, <laughs> with um, being able to perform behind a condenser microphone and practice, uh, and I think practice helps with that, uh, the better you'd be able to perform when you're actually called for a real life recording. Um, and finally, the last tip that I would give you guys that that give you guys give you guys to constantly keep putting things out there because nowadays you know the world is at our fingertips it's it's in our cell phones a lot of artists um today who are doing playback are getting um noticed by the work that they post online i mean as compared to how we were with audio cds i think that is the current audio cd demo um that reaches far more people than than it would physically going and hand delivering to composers and a lot of people are noticed by that and and they get playback opportunities right there so uh please keep posting stuff and i hope you've checked out my latest release it's called siahi it's an independent song uh it's uh featuring one of my favorite voices in the country Bapon and my friend Sid Paul has arranged the track. Please go ahead and check it out the song is up on Bapon's uh youtube channel as well as on all major audio streaming platforms so there's no way you're gonna miss it no excuses go check the song out check out siahi <laughs> and don't forget to share it like it comment on it and tell me how you like it as well you can tag me at sasha sublime on instagram and twitter um we would all love to hear from you so good luck to everybody uh these tips that i've given you are not they're not the only ways of getting work but these are certain things that worked the most for me and i really hope that this helps and helps you in getting playback opportunities as well and good luck and i love you guys and until the next tutorial video thanks for watching this is cold so good So good. I love Tim Hortons.